Hello Lola, I'm Karim Gerber, I'm a region manager of Oris and I take care about everything which is uh, aviation here. The idea came across to do right after a flying because we had all the airplanes and all the material already there. So the idea came across to open it a little bit to the public that every pilot which has an airplane around in Switzerland, Germany, France, Italy can come and join us uh, for the weekend. And there are several points. Uh, first point is of course accuracy. It has to be precise. Readability, because uh, during navigating terrestrial navigation you have to fly, you have to control uh, your airplane there's a lot of things to do at the same time, so the readability is important that you just can check, okay, two minutes, good, next leg. First it was in the 1990s when the Swiss Air Force uh, decided to stop operations with the Hunter. Then some enthusiasts around our chief pilot, Paul Rupeine, they decided to take two of uh, these airplanes and try to to keep them in the air but privately operated. This was quite uh, a big story as well for all the for all the approvals from the from the civil aviation office and everything. Uh, in fact they managed. Uh, those planes are still flying and we work with the Swiss Hunter team since 2009 and since then the, the name is uh, Boris Swiss Hunter team because we are the, the main the main sponsor. I mean a real watch is for real people we live that. An Oris is not a watch meant to buy it and then to put it in a safe. It's really built to, to wear it every day and I would say the typical Oris customer is not a, not a super rich guy. Uh, the real Oris customer is uh, a real person which is hard working, which is living his dream and uh, investing everything to, to reach his goals and targets. And that's what we do and I think uh, we live in the same way as well here at Oris.